as Nigerians mark the country's Armed Forces Remembrance Day. Delta State Governor Right Honorable Sharif Oberwori on Monday led top military officers and others to lay at the statue of the unknown soldier in Asaba, the state capital. Armed Forces Remembrance Day is observed on January 15 every year to remember soldiers who paid the supreme price in various peacekeeping operations and the Nigerian Civil War. The event is also to raise awareness on the plight of the widows and children left behind by these fallen heroes and those still alive, as well as the need to help them. These men are veterans who are to be celebrated and honored as VIPs for putting their lives in harm's way and laying them down for the nation. Governor Boriwori arrived the cenotaph, venue of the solemn ceremony, inspected the guard of honor mounted by the Nigerian Army, Nigerian Air Force, Nigerian Navy, and members of the Nigerian Legion. A minute silence was observed and a 21-gun salute taken in honor of the departed heroes of the country. <laughs> High point of the event was the release of pigeons by Governor Boriwori, signaling peace and the people's determination to avoid any action that could lead to violence or war. This year's event also included an emblem launch, a special thanksgiving service in memory of the departed, as well as others affected by conflict and culminated with the laying of wreck. The State Deputy Governor, Samonde Uyeme, Speaker of the Delta State House of Assembly, Right Honorable Imam Timi Gowo, represented by his deputy, Chief Judge of Delta State, Justice Teresa Dai, represented by Justice Kwame Oki, Commander of Different Ministry Formation in the state, Commissioner of Police, Delta State CP, Wale Abbas, Chairman of the State's Traditional Rulers Council, Religious leaders, chairman of the Nigerian Legion, Delta State, and representative of the widows, amongst others, they greet at the event to honor the departed heroes. The high point of the event was the release of pigeons by Governor Boriwori, signaling peace and the people's determination to avoid any action that could lead to violence or war. This year's event also included an emblem launch, a special thanksgiving service in memory of the departed, as well as others affected by conflict and culminated with the laying of wreck.
Department of Culture State, right on the wall, Elder.